Well, 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 we got ourselves a brand spanking new gameplay trailer for Pokemon Legends Arceus. I haven't watched it yet, so actually we're just going to do this live together. Let's go through this Pokemon Legends Arceus gameplay trailer and see what exactly is coming down the pike for Pokemon Legends Arceus. I'm really excited. Let's get after it. Here we go. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Welcome, trainers. Thanks for joining us today. The Hisu Region. Game, Beautiful. Pokemon Legends Arceus. Just January look at this footage, guys. Exclusively on the Nintendo Switch system. Today, looks good. We wanted to give you a first look at some new gameplay. Okay. So let's begin. Your adventure is set in the expansive Hisui region. In an age long I really ago, like the style, that's for sure. Pokemon to live in close harmony. There's a lot of information here. Hisui will Definitely a lot of information here. <laughs> Mount Coronet rises from the center of the Hisui region. Kind of knew some of this. The slow walking is a little bit interesting to me, but look okay, look at the HUD. There it is. is rich in natural features and plays host interesting. So you can have berries. Looks like there's a Pokeball. One such area is the Obsidian Fieldlands. Which you can see the trainer exploring here. Yeah. The area is filled with Pokemon that call meadows and forests their home. Each okay. area in Hisui has loads to discover, and you should make that sure is uh, honestly, if that is all playable area, that's explore. pretty remarkable. I'm ex I'm excited to see what that to craft like any items that will help you on your journey, including healing items. Auto targets a bit of smoke bombs, a mysterious invention called a Pokeball, and more. Oh, okay, you can run. Team can help you collect these materials too. You can find all kinds of useful resources across the region just by breaking rocks. Oh, that's kind of cool. Plants growing in the wild grass. Oh my gosh, this looks so dope. Items out of trees. Of course. Here we see the trainer using some of the materials they have collected oh to my craft items and gosh. The next mission. That's cool. Oh yeah, this is it. Wild Pokémon. What are we doing with wild Pokémon? All kinds of Pokemon will appear depending on the time of the day and the weather condition. Different species of Pokemon also have different temperaments. Some may ignore you as you approach. See, like see the draw distance is pretty far out there. I wonder how far you can actually go. Are skittish and will run away if they see you approaching. There are even aggressive Pokemon that will attack you should they spot you in the wild. Throw a rock at it. If an aggressive Pokemon spots you. Or if you fail to catch it on your first sneak attempt... Oh my gosh! <laughs> you dodge out of the way, and you toss out your Pokemon, Pokemon, and then you start a battle! By the Pokemon. That is you so cool! Pokemon, you must battle. <laughs> you can initiate a battle by throwing a Pokemon... Oh my gosh, that's incredible! Wow. Wow, that's pretty freaking cool. I'm not going to lie. Holy moly, dude. That's cool. I like that. I like the little, like, pew. You can use items to your advantage when catching wild Pokemon. This is going to be For pretty example, insane. Throwing a berry near a Pokemon will distract it. The Pokemon will then start eating. While eating... See, this is the Pokemon game that... Allowing you to go in for a it's fast. gonna be a little different because it would be interesting to combine this with the traditional like linear story. Let me know in the comments below. Do you want to see that the like a combination of the two? Oh wow! You have to be careful. These Pokemon will not think twice about attacking you. If you take too much damage, you will black out and lose some of the items you were carrying when you fainted. Oh. Okay, so your health is actually in question. That's pretty dope. As part of the Survey Corps, you are on a mission to catalog and research all the different Pokemon that live in the harsh environments of Hisui. Not only will you need to catch many types of Pokemon on your mission, but you will also need to observe them using certain moves. So it's an observation. Okay, so it's a research-based you game. You're not really doing what... Professor Laventon. You traditionally would do in a Pokemon game. This will update your Pokedex as well as increase your rank. The gameplay looks great. You will also I really hope that it maintains that. I'm really curious to see how the Nintendo Switch handles it. Oh, it's a lot of different sections. The vastness of the Hisui region is daunting to explore on foot. Luckily. Throughout your adventure, you will encounter a number of special Pokemon wow. that will help you get to This is this is really honestly it's really beautiful. 
Weird Ear helps you navigate on land faster. But like, how, is all of that playable? Allows you to soar through the skies. Basque Legion allows you to traverse the rivers and seas throughout the Hisui region. If these Pokemon how much side, of this is playable? To explore the Hisui like, to your heart's content. That's huge. That's massive. The village is the center of operations for the Galaxy Expedition Team. A group made up of people who have come from different regions to stay yeah. and live in the harsh region of Kisu. Oh, the galaxy team includes various corps, such this as the gonna be so corps cool. security corps, as well as the survey corps, which carries out research on how Pokemon live. Jubilife Village will serve as the base for your surveying missions. Wow. After receiving a mission or a request and preparing for your next excursion, You'll set out from the village to study one of the various areas of the Hisui region. Okay. After you finish your survey work, you'll return once more to prepare for your next. So I'm task. curious how. Along with the headquarters of the Galaxy Team and your own. Logic, is it like Breath of the Wild? You know. Also home to a variety of different services, such as the clothier. Oh, he really has the, the traditional stuff, and I love and the it. Trading post, where you can trade Pokemon with other players. Oh. You can receive a variety of different missions and requests. Oh, this is this game. This game's gonna take over stream. Requests. This game's gonna take over stream. Tasks that you do to help the residents of Hisui, while missions will advance the main story. Once you receive a mission or request, it will be added to your Arc Phone. The Arc Phone is a mysterious device that allows you to track your movements. I love how it's the phone is a mysterious device. It's also kind of funny because that technology wouldn't have existed back then. Vary in their objectives. Some examples of these objectives include discovering a specific this art Pokemon, style is incredible. Finding a variety of different items, defeating powerful Pokemon in battle, or catching a number of one specific Pokemon for research. Please enjoy this clip of a trainer completing a request. Ooh, real gameplay. Here we go. So now you have to go out and see it. Do I take a... Oh. So it looks like it... Do you just chuck a Pokeball? Oh. That's... <laughs> that... <coughs> Excuse me. That's so cool. I love that the confirmation that you got the Pokemon is a little firework. That's incredible! Oh, that is so good. That is so cool! This is... That's something else, man. Ooh, battles. Battle system. You can initiate a Pokemon battle by throwing one of your partner's Pokeballs at or near a wild Pokemon. If a wild Pokemon does not see you approaching and you strike them with one of your partner's Pokeballs, this will catch them unaware and may grant you an extra chance to attack in battle. Oh, nice. So it is still turn-based, which is cool. Dang. Dude, this mechanic mixed with, like, Sword and Shield. Holy moly. Chat. This isn't. Strong I said chat. This isn't chat. Guys, comment below what kind of style would you rather it be linear, more linear, like a like a Pokemon X or Y, or would you want it more open world, like Sword and Shield? I guess Sword and Shield is kind of linear. But using them may delay your Pokemon's next turn. If an enemy can withstand one of your strong style moves, prepare to be attacked multiple times in retaliation. Using agile style moves and strong style moves in battle causes your Pokemon's attacks to use more PP. So be careful when planning your battles. Wow. Is the key to victory. While surveying the wild, you may come across a Pokemon that appears different to the others of the same species. These are known as Alpha Pokemon, 
and are much larger and have glowing red eyes. Be careful when approaching them if you are not prepared. They are very aggressive and will take a powerful team and strategy to take down. Dude, this is really, Here, really the intricate. Uses agile style thunder wave to paralyze their opponent, delaying their turns and making them easier to catch. While also changing this is very much so the Pokemon game I think a lot of people have been wanting. Strategies like this are key to defeating Alpha Pokemon. Catching an Alpha Pokemon is a challenge, but if you manage it, they will be a very powerful ally in your adventure. Ooh, Billy, that's a big attack. It can attack both? Ooh, ooh, customizations. This is, this is, ooh, ooh. By visiting the clothier, you can customize your character with a variety of different clothing items. Is it just colors? As you progress through the game, oh, no. you will unlock more outfits. Oh, outfits. sick! Make sure to pick a style that speaks to you. Here is a quick look at some of the early customization options that trainers can wear. Uh, pretty normal. You can also customize your trainer's hairstyle, hair color, and eyebrow color at the hairdresser. That's kind of cool. Region can be dangerous, but that doesn't mean you can't look your best. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Well done. Okay. Noble Pokemon? During your adventure, you will have to face off against special Pokemon called Noble Pokemon. Yeah. A strange phenomenon is causing the nobles to become frenzied, making them rampage. As part of the Survey Corps, you will be recruited to calm these frenzied nobles. That is so cool. Simply defeating them in battle will not calm them. You will have to quell their frenzy by throwing bombs made using these noble Pokemon's favorite foods. It can be difficult to hit a rampaging noble with these bombs, as they will relentlessly attack you. Oh my goodness gracious. Where's your HP? Did you see it anywhere? As many bombs as you can. Just like throwing a Pokemon, wow, this is to aim carefully. This Noble is Pokemon so sick. The player directly, and if you take too much damage, you will black out and need to attempt the battle again. Balance throwing your bombs with dodging attacks to calm the Noble Pokemon. At some point during the fight, the Noble Pokemon may let down its guard. And you this set out a Psyduck? A and start a Pokemon battle. I guess that's kind of a... Uh... These battles are tough. Planning ahead is essential if you wish to calm the noble Pokemon. Oh, down. there it is. Agile style, strong style. Okay, I see. Stronger style. It takes more PP to do. And wow, that's uh, that's pretty cool. This might actually... I mean, because the last game that I played, Diamond, it was okay. But this might actually pull me in and be like, get me we hope you enjoyed really the sucked in. Of Pokemon Legends. Arceus. Holy moly. Countless adventures await you in the Hisui region. Wow, you just we cannot shot you. wait okay. for you to get your hands on the game after it releases on January 28th, exclusively on Nintendo Switch. Wow. We will see you very soon. Hisui. Wow. Bye. Love it. Well, guys, uh, I am more than impressed with that. I am more than impressed with that. Available January 28th. That's a Friday. Oh my goodness gracious, guys. Well, if you guys enjoyed my reaction, that's a true reaction. I'm still kind of taken aback by it. That's so freaking cool. If you guys want to see me play this, I am going to be streaming this live uh, on launch day to play it because it's going to be amazing. And uh, also, you guys, if you want to see more of my content, it's really simple. Just hit the uh, subscribe button. Go ahead and hit the bell notification so you always get notified when we're doing live streams and all that kind of stuff. Hit the like button because that helps this channel grow. Somehow, like really, really helps. But most of all, and you guys know this, it's always been the case, and I'm going to say it, happy gaming.